The National Rugby League returns tomorrow with five fixtures at different grounds. Table leaders Cobes will host Rhinos at Legends Rugby Ground. Another mouth-watering clash will see Stanbic Black Pirates, who are third on the table, play against Makere Impis, who are seeking to better their performance after a string of losses in their previous fixtures. <laughs> Pirates who have extended their partnership with Stanbic Bank, gaining 8 million Uganda shillings per year for a period of two years, are optimistic about victory. We are good to go, you know. Uh, MPC is never on this side. They come really hard at us. Uh, but we are prepared. We are good to go. And yeah, I am positive that we shall come out with a win. It's a very, very good side. Well drilled, well coached. Uh, we'll try our best to defend as much as we we should because we don't expect to have the ball much of the time during the game, but uh, use the ball when we have it and defend as much as we can. That's the Stanbic Bank support to Pirates is intended to see them develop the sport as well as enable players to gain from their hard work. Stanbic has also employed many of our players uh, to, to have full-time jobs. So all of our players have, if you're not in school, you have a full-time job. Outside of that, we are planning, we, we, are, we are structuring schemes with the Stanbic hierarchy, schemes like uh, insurance. You know, in places like South Africa, England, France, and so on, that there have been youngsters that have aspired to be great rugby players that have created great careers for themselves. Why, can, why can't Uganda become an example? Of that. Elsewhere, defending champions Heathens Rugby Club will make a short trip to Jinja to take on Walukuba Barbarians, while bottom placed Rams will seek for a first win when they do host Jinja Hippos at the graveyard in Makere. <laughs>